this tutorial, we will create a text entry variable where the learner will enter their name for the developer to use during the project. This is one way to personalize your course, module, or lesson. First, let's look at the finished product. On this slide, the learner is directed to enter their name. We use that name to greet them on the next slide. I've also used it in the feedback pop-up box on this multiple choice question. And finally, I've used it on the quiz results slide. This could be especially useful if the training is mandatory or there is a certificate to print. All right, let's get started. So the first thing we want to do is go to our insert tab and under interactive objects, input, data entry, and this text entry field. And we're gonna create a box here you can format it however you like. You can make it a little smaller. And we can change this text here. Uh, maybe change this to name. Maybe center it. Change the font, whatever you'd like. Okay. And what that is going to do is going to create a variable. And if you go up to the, the upper right up here, manage project variables, you'll see text entry. This is the box we just made. And if you want to edit that, maybe you're going to use multiple variables. Um, maybe change it to name entry. All right, there we go. So on our next slide, I want to put this right here. I'm going to go to insert reference and I only have one variable I'm gonna say okay all right these little percentages around um, whatever is between the percentages is what's gonna show next slide I want to insert this variable into my feedback And there's no way to do this in the form view, so um, I'm going to have to go back and I'm just going to copy. And then paste it. Okay, next on my final slide, I'm going to put it on the results slide. I still have it copied, so I can just paste, or you could also go back up to insert, reference, put it in there, and let's check it out and see if it works. Right. Tom Wiggins. Nice to meet you, Tom Wiggins. Check the incorrect. Tom Wiggins. Tom Wiggins. And Tom Wiggins. Oh, we got to take that period out right there. Other than that, it works just fine. So there you go. Adding a text entry variable to your Articulate Storyline project, maybe to add a little personalization or to serve some other purposes that you may see fit. All right, thank you.